Mary's an extremely passionate teacher, an amazing mentor, and a great friend. And uh, she's done a lot for the department and the university. I've been at UNH for 14 years now. I teach courses on Latin American politics, on the drug wars, on U.S. foreign policy, and democratization. One thing that I love about UNH is that the students, especially the political science majors, are so active politically. They have really strong opinions about what's going on in the world. Um, they're really interested in actually learning more to kind of inform their opinions. They just bring a lot of enthusiasm to the classroom. She's the expert in Latin America. And she opened my eyes as someone who has a PhD in political science to some of the uh, intricacies of what's going on, especially in Latin America. I lived in Argentina for two years. I was a volunteer in a rural orphanage there. And really after that, I just became fascinated by the region and just really engaged in how exactly people could kind of change a very unequal status quo in Latin America. Mary's study abroad programs, I know that she spearheaded a really popular program with Costa Rica, and I also know she's been very active in advocating for the rights of immigrants, especially helping the courts so they know kind of what people are fleeing when they are coming to the U.S., and she's the expert and the advocate. I go to the region usually once a year, sometimes more than once a year. I do research, I sometimes take students there. I work with activists in the region and you know, in a variety of issues. Right now what I'm working most on is uh, drug policy and how U.S. drug policy and domestic drug policy in Latin America might be able to change to correspond to lower levels of violence in the region. She's not just teaching this in the classroom, she lives Latin American politics and justice and what she teaches and she's a real inspiration.